ehacking.net. It's not hacking, it's ehacking. Welcome student to the another chapter named PSTN or the same section that is foundation of wipe penetration testing. The objective of this chapter is to analyze PSTN deeply and the techniques that are associated with PSTN. The, uh, the second objective of this chapter is to discuss the application of switching that discussed earlier in the previous chapter. Before going to the main course, let's take a look into appetizer. These are the widely used terms. It is very important to understand the concept of these terms because uh, we are going to use them frequently and also it is it makes you to understand uh, the complete scenario of telephonic system mesh network mesh network is a kind of network topology in other words technique to design a network in mesh network each devices are connected with the other devices on the same network the biggest disadvantage of mesh network is the many redundant interconnection uh, between devices. Okay, trunk. Trunk is a line, is basically a, a line, a line, basically simple line that is always digital and it can handle many signals at a time. The main job of trunk is to provide connection to multiple devices so that they can connect with the central office. Bit rate is the number of bits per second that can be transmitted along a digital network. You might have uh, uh, heard this word in Hacker Manifesto, Manifesto when they say the beauty of the bot. Bot, so here is the bot. Bot rate is the data transmission rate which is signal per second so there is a difference between bit rate and a baud rate bit rate is the number of bits transmitted per second while the baud rate is the number of signal signaling element basically the frequency that sends per second anyways yes pstn pstn or public switched telephone network was invented in 1870s by graham bell uh, the shape of PSTN was changed over a period of time and many new techniques were incorporated to make this technology economical, uh, economical and helpful. You may find PSTN as pots. This is pots. Yeah. Uh, or plain old telephone service in older books. It is actually based on circuit switching technique that has uh, been discussed earlier a dedicated channel used to assign for each call phone call directed um, through switches to its destination before the advent of WLL this is wireless local loop the PSTN was wide network and it uses copper wire for connection these wires carry analog signal that is subjected to distortion and even uh, this can this can be corrupted okay more information or more discussion at this stage you need to understand the difference between data rate and the bandwidth although both are measuring parameter to determine the speed of data transmission but data rate is where we refer digital data while bandwidth is when we talk about analog data or uh, uh, okay 64 kilobits per second is the data rate that can be achieved in traditional telephonic system while the modem device the while the modem device that has a functionality to convert digital data into analog and then modulate it uh, for further transmission can achieve up to 56 kilobits per second here signaling system number seven 
which is also referred as SS7 here uh, is the protocol used in TSTN to carry control signals. VoIP has its own set of protocols that we that we, that we will discuss in VoIP chapter in detail. Even in computer networking, we have FTP, SSH, and many other protocols that we will discuss in TCP/IP chapter in detail. SS7 is also called out of bond um, signaling because it uses a separate channel to transfer data uh, to transfer signals actually so so when you use ss7 ss7 use a, a separate line or separate channel to transfer the signals while the data will be transferred by using the separate channel so let's summarize this is the overview of PSTN from where it started, what it was and what it became. The VoIP has successfully replaced PSTN and even we are not going, uh, we are not using copper wire anymore. We have fiber optics to achieve the higher data rate equivalent to speed of light. Beyond this chapter onwards we will focus on digital technology so that we can move into VoIP. Network. Till time. Bye.